My name is Jack. I was born in Korea, and I live in Terrytown, New York right now. Uh, my name is Noah Senegal. I'm 17 years old, and I'm from Seoul, Korea, but I live in Montville, New Jersey. My family is Irish and Italian. There, I have another adopted sister that goes to this camp. Her name is Ella. And then I have two other brother, a brother and a sister, both older, both in college. And uh, they're white. My parents, or my family's very different. Um, my dad is of Turkish descent, um, and my mom is Hungarian, Irish, and German. Um, and my older sister is a mixture of the two, and I have a younger sister who was also adopted from Korea. Growing up as an adoptee, people have this mentality that they have to feel sorry for you um, because you don't know your parents and you're growing up in a different place, and they have this label for you that you're always wondering about something. And, um, at times it's true, you don't fit in with the white community because you don't look like them, you have to deal with the racial slurs, but you don't fit in with the Asian community because you don't understand the culture and you don't speak the language. But then at the same time, you need to know that you're lucky. And the reason I come here is to give it back to the younger adoptees so they experience the same thing that I did. I went with the camp for the first time uh, for two weeks last year. Um, and the biggest surprise was going to Holt and I actually met my foster parents. Um, and it's a very frustrating experience because I had to have a translator and they really don't want to tell you stuff um, and it seems impersonal because you're not getting it firsthand um, and it goes very quickly um, but having a personal connection and seeing a face that you recognize is really something special. The first thing I had was tears of confusion and joy and um, on the bus right there all I had were questions that I was going to ask her wondering why or what reason. And when I got there, it was just pure joy. Yeah, I did meet my foster parents too. Okay. It was kind of awkward. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know what to ask. So it was a very short time and I had to have to, I had a translator too. So it was very frustrating too. I know my birth mom was 17 or 18 years old. So I kind of understand why she was young, but I don't really know anything about my dad. The first question I, was, I would ask is, why was I put up for adopted? And then when she would tell me, I, would, I wouldn't know what else to say. I would just be confused. I wouldn't know what I would feel. I would probably feel a little hurt still, but our relationship would probably grow better throughout the time but it would take a while for that to happen. I know little to nothing about my uh, birth family. I do know that my father was a soldier um, and I believe my mom was a nurse. So my family's really supportive of what I wanna do. Um, and they think it's a privilege that I'm here. Um, they're always worried that um, my birth mother over there is worrying about me. And the only thing they wanna see is um, for her or for my dad to see that um, how I am today, that I'm successful, that I'm happy, and that I'm healthy. Being adopted is really unique. Um, uh, you're, there are times where you're at your lowest um, and you're angry um, and you're really sad sometimes uh, because you have no connection to who you are. Um, at times you maybe will never know who you are. Um, but really being adopted is part of being hopeful. Um, and all you can be is um, stay true to yourself and um, believe in what you can do. I know a lot of adopted parents um, hesitate to see their children um, because they have the shame that they had to give you up, um, that they haven't been able to raise you. But I think if I were to meet her or him, um, the first thing I would say is thank you um, because just looking at me now and just being adopted into a good family. Um, I really am really lucky. My name is Jack McGovern. My Korean name is Sung Joon, and this is my Korean American story. My name is Noah Sinegil. My Korean name is Sohun Kim, and this is my Korean American story. Mm -hmm.